What's up, it's your boy, Yo Mama, and let's get to that Madden drama. First in the news, DreamHack threw a massive Madden tournament this weekend for $20,000. There was drinking, there was dancing, and there was Madden. And the winner was my man, Dreamy. Congratulations, Dreamy. We here at the Drama Network salute you. And uh, with that $20,000, man, can you please uh, buy a bigger bed? I'm not trying to, you know, tell a man what to do with his room but i mean you sleep in a maybe that worked for you i don't know maybe that makes you a better batting player when you get out of bed when you roll out of bed and fall on the floor i don't know um maybe i don't know whatever you're doing right now is working for you so i say don't switch it up and if you was too busy this weekend and you missed that madden dream hack tournament i think we'll see a stretch here uh, yeah right <laughs> And Maddox has no chance. Ooh. And you didn't want to go for it because of... Um, <laughs> yeah. Wait, wait yeah. for it. Oh, no. Maybe oh. Oh. 20 minutes later. Motions that receiver in the block. He's got three routes. Great defense by Safa. Box. That one's box. Wow. wow. Phenomenal defense by... What? Wait. Oh, my. Oh, my. Look at Safa's face. Safa didn't even know what's going he on. Safa got up. Safa got up. He was yelling at Fancy. He didn't realize the play was still going. Stretch to the left. Stretch to the right. You didn't really miss nothing. Also in the news, Rico Williams fired. What y'all doing, son? As I get ready to do my final Madden game, I just want to thank a wonderful community for showing me so much love and allowing me to be. <laughs> now you might be asking yourself, this doesn't mean he got fired. And then this was tweeted. Hashtag legend, hashtag Uncle Rico. Hashtag look out for me since day one. Hashtag you better be back. I didn't want to leave. <laughs> oh, God. I just kind of wonder how this all went down because he did say during the stream that after he was going to Chipotle. So, Welcome back, Rico. How can we help burrito. you? Uh -huh. Let me let me look at that bowl. Yeah, Damn. Yeah. Let me get the tacos. Throw that salad in there. Matter of fact, just give me the whole left side. Yeah, Oof. yeah, an extra pico de gallo. That's you want chips mama. and guac with that? Of course I want the chips and guac. Gonna goddamn damn question. Hey, yo, Rico. What? They said they fired your I'm ass, fired. big dog. Damn it. Want anything <sighs> else? In a bag? Just give me the white side, you. too. Damn. And looking at this tweet, do you think Rico was looking to RG for help? Well, that's not a good idea. Oh, man. I can't believe you're backing that up, RG. What do you like, want, what do you want it to do? Happen. My cornerback should never teleport from the left to the right. It just shouldn't happen. It's been happening. It's a, it's a... Also, in the news, if you commit a crime, EA Sports will not allow you to play in any more tournaments. It's a lot of niggas right there. Following a recent tournament, we become aware that two EA Sports Madden NFL 20 Championship Series competitors have a felony criminal history. It is our policy that players... Fear not. For behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy. But is EA Sports wrong? Because one of the felons, I kind of believe that he shouldn't have that opportunity of playing amongst other Madden players. I mean, his crimes were egregious. Harris was convicted in 2017 of harassing and threatening the underage girl over nude photos that he had in his possession. In May of 2017, Harris pleaded guilty to intimidation, which is a class three felony in the state of Illinois. Harris, who was 21 at the time, admitted that he tried to threaten his victim because he wanted her to send him more nude photos. Another piece of evidence that Clifton presented included an instance where Harris allegedly forced a male to perform a sex act on him when Harris was 15. That incident was supposedly not reported to police until 18 months later. Harris, according to Clifton, also reportedly tried to shoot nude photos of three people, two females and a male, by posing as a representative of a professional photographer. This allegedly happened in 2016, after Harris was already released on bond for the previously mentioned charges. Now, one God damn, this man was doing some wild shit. 
not only did this man get convicted of taking nudes off of a computer of an underage girl, but he also tried to blackmail her. And then he got a history uh. when he was younger at 16, basically raping another boy, you know, forcing another boy to lick his genitals. I mean, God, after he was convicted and did two years in prison, he came out of jail and did another crime, basically posing as a photographer in a fake studio and getting nudes of other people. I mean, this is the kind of guy that, you know, you give a chance to, he does the time, and then he does it again. No, 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 no. We don't need this guy around, okay? You would have thought that everybody in the Madden community could come together on this one. Wrong. People are miserable. Soon as someone is happy and accomplishing something, they try their best to make sure that person is as miserable as they are. What the fuck? But no, he didn't stop there. He decided to make a video about it. Fame Nate is 23 years old, okay? He's 23 years old, he's a young man. Now, if you guys watch the club series, Fame Nate, I will tell you, was probably the most well-spoken man player we have ever heard. Everybody can't read around it. this word ped pedophile. Mm -hmm. Right, chat? That's all y'all do around this word pedophile. Okay. I never thought none of this really went into that. It's all bad now. That that word alone is a little scary. Debbie's reading. And I thought people, and I feel like when I was talking about this and we were talking about it, we were going around, everybody was doing it around without really knowing what it was. You know what I'm saying? Debbie's reading. No, seriously, because I, I I feel like that makes shit sound so much worse. It, ma it makes it seem like <laughs> super, super freak. Man. What? You know what I'm saying? What? Go ahead. <clears throat> Go ahead, dude. You know, and I didn't I didn't think it was that that super net. And we Harris was convicted in 2017 of harassing and threatening the underage girl over nude photos that he had in his possession. Debbie says, eh, it wasn't that bad. Also in the news, J Mel Flo. In his latest video, he is exposing D Jones? Huh? Here's why this funeral is happening, y'all. Y'all really didn't think I can beat these dudes. So here we go. This is my Christmas to y'all. Cause I owe this to y'all. Y'all wanted me to play these people, you feel me? First up, cause we just mash up in a random game, y'all promise. But y'all keep thinking these dudes is good, and they boo boo for Coco Puffs. That boy is good. Mm -hmm. Good and terrible. Wait a minute. You think you play D Jones? You jumped in a random rank match and see a guy with the game tag D Jones? It wasn't even like a salary cap ladder or a draft champions ladder. It was a regs rank match and let me break it to you mr j mail flow uh most madden pros don't use their real name like uh i mean dude everybody knows that d jones has been in the mental hospital since august his last video post was august 21st we don't feel comfortable with him at tournaments anymore ban him from the esport ban him from the actual sports too because i go over to the park over here to throw the ball around or kick the ball around Police officers show up and arrest me for it. And no shot that D. Jones has been playing Madden unless he turned himself into the Joker, broke out of the mental hospital, ran home just to play a random rank match against you. Also in the news, let's stay on this J-Mail flow. It looks like J-Mail won't be posting up videos in a long while because it looks like his girlfriend is sick. His girlfriend ariana grande had to leave a concert due to sickness oh man yeah <sighs> hope you brought her some soup jmail flow and that's all that we have for you here at the drama network see you guys next time make sure you like subscribe and comment below it's your boy yo mama